Let's warm up today with a sketch of a garden snail using willow charcoal, compressed charcoal, and a charcoal pencil. Sweep across your page with your willow charcoal creating a line of action, and then swirl in a large circle for the shell and two smaller ones for the body. Now go ahead and draw the outline of the body around the two smaller circles. Erase your line of action and your inside lines in the snail's body. And let's correct the contour line of the shell itself using our photo reference. Throw on the tail and two small circles for the ends of the antennae. And then you can go ahead and connect those ends to the head. Use your willow charcoal to tone the snail's body and blend it lightly with your finger. And then use your charcoal pencil to darken the stripes and any shadows and details you see. Now take your willow charcoal and add some shadows to the shell, look at the photo reference, and then use your charcoal pencil to outline it lightly and to add some of those very subtle lines that are going across it horizontally. Now pick up your compressed charcoal and holding it on its side, sweep in some tone underneath the snail for the rock and then darken it where it's darker underneath the snail. Our lesson today is about one-point linear perspective. We'll look at this famous painting and analyze the perspective lines. We'll start a new project today, a drawing of a covered bridge with an interesting point of view. It's from the inside looking out. Our first task is to draw in the perspective lines using a ruler and some simple guidelines. Let's get started.